Welcome back to another episode of FTB Interactions. Today, we're starting to do range add-ons. I have already begun to work on, wait, hmm, oh, I thought it was a progression. We don't need that. We don't need the fur, the, the like one, two, we don't need the first three. So I have already upgraded this three and basically it's, you surround it with other things and then you add this in the middle and it'll become a higher level one. But not for these. So an 11, 10, ten yeah. See, jumps jumps the gun there. Goes from two to three to four. Look at that. So these first three are useless. So we got a three. Now we move on to a four. Because we need oil. Oh, I need also four. I need these. Poly. Poly, yeah, uh, the thing. Yep. So we need range four. That one. So I get that. Five. Now we need copper and poly. So we just need copper. Plates and we don't have any copper plates around. Do we have any copper ingots? I can never remember what to do with this stuff. I feel like I need to throw it in a. It's been a couple days. Isn't there a chemical bath? the old Try to throw, try to throw it in this. Oh, oh, that. And I'm still wrong, idiot. <gasps> that was my problem all along. Now I don't know what what I was supposed to do. When I was supposed to do it, I couldn't tell you. So if I do this and I put these in here, nope. What about right here? I don't know a thing. I felt like a moron. Why 
why does nothing work for me? What happened to the good old days where you just throw it in and it would cook? You know what I mean? You just throw stuff in and they cook. I miss those days. Can I bring it over here? What if I did this? Can I do that? I can. <laughs> boots they wore out quiet you you just go there you stay oh I went the wrong way oh yeah I can't walk over stuff all willy dilly What'd you get? What are you up to? Making a range add-on. Getting all the pieces okay? Um, yeah, I just, uh, but I did, oops, I did realize that the first three are, let's see here, one, two, the f first you can go up to level three, range three with them, and you recycle the add-on itself. But to get up to 12, you actually have to start with a range four, which you you make really? out of a out of a, like an integrated circuit or a good electronic circuit. Oh. Yeah. So I upgraded it. Like we have a we have a level three <laughs> for nothing. Yeah. Well, we can use that for something. Yeah, yeah. I There's mean, other machines like, that use that. Right. I mean, not for, like, our purposes right here. So, actually, what I need to do is I need to... Ah, I knew it. Um, it does it again. It recycles again at 7. And then at 10. Wow. I'm glad I looked. Well, at... that... Huh. <laughs> Ooh. That might be a little much. Quantum processor. I will be there momentarily. Okay. Small coil SMD capacitor. Oh, I don't know about those, man. Fine electrum wire. Hmm. I th here I was thinking that the hardest thing we were going to have to come up with was um, <sighs> like uh, nether quartz stuff. Was it nether quartz? This one? Ugh, I never know what goes where.
what I do know is I'm about to fall asleep what was the next one well, there's one at seven that was it and go. Yeah, Did you say you just weren't wanting to go straight to 12? Um, well, I don't think that's possible. Well, I mean, it's going to be like huge undertaking in itself just to do that so I don't know if that's wise right now we can a do quant oh a quantum processor nando okay yeah so, so... technically we can start at seven do the nine huh yeah nether quartz is easy gold is easy we need silver though. We need to find silver. We need silver plates. Gold, yeah. Silver plates, that's easy. Okay. Do we have. Oh, I didn't even look for silver ingot. Oops. Can I get my boots, please? Thank you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Should be able to just compress this. Compressing. Hello. My game is now lagging. Okay. Okay, got the block of silver. Now we'll cut this block in half. In pieces, something like that. Okay, you got nine silver plates. One, two, three, four, five, six. There you go. What was the other part of it? Poly tetra Pablo for the love for the weird of the Good thing I have some of that. <laughs> And then we the now next. have a three, five, and a seven. What's the seven's next step? Gold, baby. Oh, gold that's plates. Pretty... Six gold plates. Got gold playing around anywhere? Yeah, we got lots of gold here. This will take just like a few seconds. Okay. Or, wait, I could just. Press these, can I? I don't. Why did I do? <sighs> I don't remember any of this. So I literally, I don't know why I did it, but I did. I could have taken the silver ingots and just put them in the bending machine and got the plates. But you know what I did? I compressed them into a block and then sawed the block and so now... <laughs> Oh my god. Yes, I'm just making extra steps. Anyways. Welcome to my world. What's next? Uh, that's eight. We need a nine. Nether quartz. Uh, okay, we need to compress quartz. Nether quartz does. Do we have any of that? Another 
quartz. That's six okay. kinds of quartz. How many do we need? Mm, you need six. Oh, look. Nether quartz. Here. So grind, do grind it. No, yeah, I'm gonna do it. Yeah, so grind it, it, macerate it into we powder. It. Yeah, we have tons of them. Worth using now. I mean, wait, which one do you want to use? <laughs> Did you remove the? Oh no, I did that, didn't I? I'm just, never mind. Okay, and then go what ahead. Do do? Uh, compress it. How do I do that? The compressor? Where's the compressor? I've never used a compressor. Oh, is there one out there? Ah, see? This is why we need a bigger base. Compressor. Easy. Oh, I found painkillers. I'm happy. <laughs> Boom. Nine. It's about as high as we're gonna go without it starting to be kinda kind of insane. Alright, so we got nine. Let's get going for the the oil then. So we can finish up this diesel. I only have 45 minutes, then I gotta go to bed. So let's okay. Get so, what are we gonna do? We gotta get out to that oil, oil derrick. Oh, hey okay then. What is that? Why is there a bunch of blue? There's a lapis chicken. I told you. It's a blue lapis chicken. And when it said lapis, I thought to myself, oh, it's going to make lapis. It did not make lapis. Blue dye. You didn't follow me. All right. Oh, I'm excited to be able to use the color blue for everything. I looked it up, and it's actually not that like it was a stupid. It was a stupid. Well, you know, I didn't know. Anyway, it was a stupid move, but it wasn't that stupid because it looks like we can actually use the stuff in the the blue dye and some some good recipes in the future. All right, this is perfect. This is the perfect time for us to be out here doing this. Half phase. Sweet. So where'd you go? I'm coming to the oil well right now. Which one do you want to drill? Probably a small one, I imagine. Well, yeah, probably. I'm at two two eleven negative. There you are. Two two eleven negative five seven seven. There you are. Okay, so here's this thing. We're gonna break it. You go right on ahead. Break whatever you think is necessary. I have dirt. If you want dirt. Alright, let's go. 
figure this out. Right over here. This one right here. Pretty close. No? Maybe? Yes? Maybe? Sure. I'm following that. Gosh dang it. Something, something down here is attacking me and I can't see it. Oh. I got... I got something going on here, bro. Oh my god. Hey, Rob, I got... I got the stack. You got the what? Oh, you pulled it off. Yeah. Cool. That was unnecessarily hard. To here. What the heck? I think you hit me. Gosh, dang it. Get up there. All right. What the frick? <laughs> I just climbed the oil. Oh, you did? Yeah. Climb the oil and then start jumping. There we go. Oh, we don't really need the transfer node if we do this the way I'm thinking. Well, you know, we could just use the transfer node to make it... Oh, uh, anyways. Oh, this right here. Going to be extract always active. This is going to be insert always active. And this is going to be. We need that mo upgrade module. Where are we going to put which machine or which thing? The bottom one? Yeah. 
Okay. Where does it go? Which one? It doesn't matter. Oh, so we'll just do that. Okay. So now if we show working area. Oh my. Whoa. How do you do that? Do you not see it? No. Really? Okay. Open the, uh, right click the fluid pump. And click this little snowball. Click the oh, oh my gosh! <laughs> that was what? way bigger than I thought it was. Oh, that's way bigger than I thought. Well, I think we're gonna get all the oil this time. <laughs> yeah, I'd say so. Okay, so I'm gonna plop this little guy on the front, Boop. and that should be filling it up with oil. And that's going to ship it back over there. I'm going to transfer rate and set all these in there. So, yep. All right. Oil is being shipped back to our base. Let's head home. What's the next step? Because that's still sending it to this reinforced drum, right? Uh, you you can pick up the drum if you want, and then put the uh one of the bigger oil reinf. Wait, is that the large one? Um, large, yeah. Okay, as long as it's the big one, that's fine. We'll wait for it to fill up. Once it's done, we'll... That's going to probably take a little bit oh, before it gets filled up. Long time, yeah. Slash. Home. Yeah, but we let that run. Nice. And then we can just... Actually, you know what? If you want, you have the one of the other reinforced large drums. We got one right here. Yeah. So break that with your pick. Okay, you have it in your hand now, right? Okay. Break this one. With my hand. And now put down the empty one in that same exact spot. So that will keep filling up, and we have a drum full of oil right there to use. 315,000. Let's go plug it in. Oh my. Let's look right here. A few days. Oh yeah, so should I... It goes right in one? that... Yeah, break that one and put it right in its spot. There, it's filling up. The crystallized oil is in the next spot. And all we needed was... Alright, the last step. We need to get nightmares. Liquid yeah. nightmares. Or, for a, an early setup, we could just manually insert some uh, stuff in. You haven't played in like four days. Now I've forgotten ever almost everything. So liquid nightmare comes from. Is that from? Um, grains of infinity, which are dropped from beasts, right? Beasts? Beasts, yeah, obtained from mo or mobs, sorry, mobs, spawned with infinity dust. Yes, so. That's the only thing. That oh, we, we, right you ha have a whole bunch in here already. Cool. Oh, the infinity dust? 
Yeah. Yeah. So you could. We could just stick some in there right now. Like, just to get it going. Right? Is that. No, no, no. Well, Infinity Dust goes in. Oh, I never programmed this light whale to. Okay, so we need this light well to be always active. And now this thing should be filling up with liquid starlight. There it goes. Alright. Now the machine's working. Look at that thing go. This, you see this advanced mixer number two? Yeah. Just now it's fun. making that... Empowered oil there. And this tank got full, so it's no longer processing. Right. So what is going on? Is there a, something wrong, or is it it's just idling? So is there a full tank somewhere? This one is not full. This one is empty. And this one's empty. Oh... We've used all of the power. So that means we're going to have to use diesel to power the rest of this. I'm glad I brought these cables with me. Oh, yeah. So then the last thing we're going to have to do here... I'm going to need another... Uh, what the heck? What? What? Did you just dump diesel what? all over the floor? How did I do that? Did you right click it with a bucket? I did. I did accidentally. But I have two buckets of diesel on me. I'm so confused. So these dynamic tanks look like they're uh, actual a blocks of storage so you can like easily like right click them with a bucket to well, pull was, stuff out. Well, that's cool, but I, I clicked it once and it dropped. That was that was really weird. Okay. Anyway. Sorry okay. About, sorry about that. I was just trying to see how much is in there. So we could just, you know, go give it some diesel like so, there, I just put 16 buckets of diesel into the uh, thing, so maybe that'll keep it going for a little bit. Into what? What is going on? Why is this not running? I feel like there's something wrong I'm missing here. Fluid, fluid, sulfuric gas, sulfuric gas. Oh, okay. Why is this not going into... Hmm. This should be coming out right here, right? Do we have any more of these polyethylene pipes? Okay, so I've caused the problem. What did you do? That's not your job. That's my job. I'm going to need more polyethylene pipe. Uh, gosh, dang it, I jump around too much. Okay. Alright, so... That's the problem with that. Now we have a new problem. I just keep on making this worse. Oh my gosh. Stop flowing. Ugh. 
Okay, now this pipe needs to go here and here. Ouch. And break that and break that, and now we're clean. Okay, good. Why isn't this working? Mm. Okay. Why is that not connecting? Gosh dang it, now it's full of... <laughs> oh. Okay, now it's connected. Okay. Alright, I need two more segments. Wait, is this two more or is it three? One, two. I need two more segments of polyethylene pipe. Ugh. That was more trouble than it was necessary. Holy F the Those are medium, right? Yep. Uh, that is so silly that I had to do that, but whatever. They have to come out of the front of the machine, I guess. <laughs> See how they the pipes have to come out the front like that? Yeah. Yeah. Alright, sulfuric gas, sulfuric naphtha. Now the machine's running. Okay. It was because that uh, output hatch here was full. So now the whole setup should be running full time oh. again. And we should be making tons and tons of uh, stuff. Nothing's moving. So, now, would you like to see the next step? Nothing's moving. Nothing's moving, what? Nothing's moving. What are you looking for? Oh, there it is, it's moving. We need to make... We need to... Make the... Char... What was it? The Shards of Infinity? Grains of Infinity. Yeah, we can do that if you want. Is that that's the last step, isn't it? Well, I mean that was for fully automating it, yes. But I was more referring to how do we get the diesel out of here? Oh, okay, well, let's do that. All right, let's escape this machine for a second. So now we need to make a tunnel. That was a compact. P2P tunnel fluid? The, it's actually just a... Wait, no, not a P2P tunnel. It's just a regular tunnel. <clears throat> you need a hopper, a compact machine wall, and a eight redstone. Uh, nine redstone, actually. I don't know if I can do a block of iron. Don't we already have some, like, like a whole bunch of compact machine walls, though? That's a good question. Yes, this box has... Yeah, we got one in here. Here you go. Look at that, we got a hopper. Now, if only we had redstone. Lots of redstone. If only. Alright. Now we go out to the miniature grazer. This 
this thing. Okay, I don't remember how to do this. Do I build this thing in here? Yes. Okay. And then I, what do I do with the redstone? You make a circle on the ground. Around it. Now you throw the last piece in. Cool. Done. We have tunnel. All right. I need advanced circuit parts. Advanced circuit parts. Perfect. That's what I want right there. So I'm making one more uh, thing that we... Uh, another dynamic out uh, tank outlet type thing. Okay. You ready? Uh, yep. Let's go back inside the machine. Now, um, where would you like the liquid to come out of the block at? Would you like it to come out of the... Maybe this wall, since it's pretty close? Yeah, I think so. Um, I don't know if... I think you can just... Ooh. Okay. Place, right click a. Ah! I'm going to. There. Try to land on that block there. Now right click the tunnel on the wall behind you there. There. You got it? Yeah. Okay. Wait, did you put it? All right. Get, go ahead and move. <laughs> I'll do the rest. What? What did I do wrong? You put it down, so I'm gonna move the valve down too. <laughs> there we go. Now they're lined up. So I'm going to set this to extract, always active, and then set this side to insert, and now we have the diesel going out through this little hole in the wall here. Okay. Oh, wait, we can control... Wait, 
Oh, you right click it to control what what side of the block it comes out of. I didn't realize it worked this easily. So that's fantastic. So I'm going to set this to make it down. So now this tunnel is basically making all the diesel that comes out is going to come out the bottom of the block. Okay. So it's always going to drain. So basically, this way is down now. Yeah. Let's go outside. Now go ahead and pick up the block. I'll pick it up. Mm -hmm. Break it like this? Yes. Why'd you break it? I can come out here with it. Hey. Okay. Try plopping it right down on top of the turbo diesel gen right here. You just filled the these the turbo diesel generator with diesel. Yeah, I did. You just made an infinite diesel generator in that molten little block. So this little block makes diesel. That's awesome. And you can carry it around and put it wherever you want. It's an entire room that you can store in your pocket. That's awesome. Alright, so now we have infinite fuel for this stuff. So, I believe you were saying you want to complete the uh, automation of it. So we would have to get grains of infinity automated, right? I think so. Okay. That might need to be a different time. I am 100% falling asleep here. Okay, then. We'll <laughs> stop here. <laughs> but this was cool. And uh, just as a primer to automate the Grains of Infinity, that has to do with blood magic, doesn't it? Right? I believe so. The, what, would you, what were you calling it? The culling? Yes, the ritual of the culling. Of the calling. Okay. I guess we'll have to do that on the next episode of FTB Interactions. Bye. Right. What? Bye. Huh? Bye. Bye. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.